You guys knew this video was coming. Just roll the intro clip. Okay, before we get started, I um, want to give you guys a little bit of a channel update. We hit a thousand views in two weeks on the last Unsupported Mac video, and I thought that was absolutely incredible. You guys are incredible. You're great. Um, let's see if we can get this one to a thousand. Maybe. Um... I'm getting kind of close to hitting 500 subscribers, and when I do, I'm going to probably rename the channel, because as much as I love AGP and as much as I've used it for years, it's not a, it's not a tech-related thing. So probably next video... I'll have some ideas for a tech name, and you guys just put your favorite one in the comments. Um, beyond that, you know, I'm looking to hit 500 subscribers by December. I've got 260 something right now. I want to hit 500 by by December. So if you like this video, if you like what I've been doing, hit the subscribe button. You know, it's free. You don't even have to watch my videos. <coughs> Although I would love it if you did. Um, oh yeah, also. I promised myself back when I actually started the channel that if I made any revenue off of it, it would go towards the channel. That day has finally come. So, um, not this Friday, but next Friday, because I've already been in contact with the people I need to be in contact with, I'm going to basically go and either buy equipment for the channel or buy a project for the channel. That's what I want you guys to vote for right now. New camera, a Raspberry Pi like computer but uses Windows, or a Hackintosh. A very cheap Hackintosh but a Hackintosh. Vote in the comments below. Okay. Uh, I think that's everything. Um, rant over. Again, basically, for those that were too long didn't listen, I appreciate everything you're doing. I really do. I did not think that my YouTube channel would go beyond my friends and I just screwing around. So, let's do this. Um, you'll have to forgive me for being in the shot. My wireless keyboard and mouse just died for the first time. Um, anyway, this is literally the exact same process as before. Except, you need to go and re-download DOS Dude 1's Sierra Patcher. Because he has updated it to work with the new public beta. So, we click it. Oh, and I assume you have the public beta. If not, it's in the description. Uh, I didn't say anything. So, we browse for the copy. My copies and applications. Install Mac OS Sierra Public Beta. You would hit open. It's verified. And then your target volume is your flash drive, which mine would be untitled. I've already done this. All you gotta do is hit start operation and wait about it's about 30 to 45 minutes. Restarts. Hold down option, like always. Mine's taking a minute to restart because I downloaded Adobe Creative Cloud last night for a project. I immediately regretted it. 
for the record, I can't stand Adobe products. So we hold that option. Move to your installer. And if all went well, you're going to have your installer again. You're going to run the installer like you would any other installer. If you want to upgrade, go ahead and upgrade. If you want to wipe your hard drive, wipe it. But run the installer like you would a Mac OS installer. After you're done doing that, you go to Utilities, Mac OS Post Install. I've already done this. You select the model of your computer. Just as a joke, I'm going to click Mac Pro. You add anything you want added, which I wouldn't recommend. I would recommend going with what it recommends. Click on your hard drive. Mine will be untitled and click Patch. I'm not going to. After it's patched, restart your computer. Okay, so the one thing you want to look for when yours is up and running is do I have USB support? Just take your mouse, jiggle it a little bit. If you have USB support, then you're done. That's it. That's everything. Congratulations. One thing I'm going to say right now. The public betas will keep getting updated. Uh, the developer betas, I don't think they do. And it's kind of okay to be on a public beta. I ran Yosemite public beta on my... 2008 Mac back when I had it um, so if you want to stop here you can I mean you'll keep getting updates as far as I know um, if you don't want to stop here then I'll you know I'll do my best for trying to get a hold of the um, the full beta if I do a Hackintosh I should have no problem doing it but um, not the full beta, but the the full release, and I'll do a video for it. But I mean, it's pretty much going to be the same instructions: run his patcher, install it, run the post install, enjoy. I mean, there's not much more you can say. Anyway, um, I hope this works for you. I mean, it worked for me. Uh, if you have any questions, leave them in the comments below. As always. Take it easy.